and welcome back to Creating with Mimi. This is our third section for the patio this summer. This is my love language. I am enjoying this. It does take a lot of time. We're outdoors. I, I'm not mic'd up, so excuse the barking dog, the airplanes, the water, everything that's going on. But I'm outdoors and I'm having a great time. The first section was the living room, then we have the dining area, and this is pretty much called just another lounge area. There's actually four sections to this back patio, but I will be addressing three. It is a little late this year for setting up, but we're, I'm in California and we're still troubled with morning drizzles. It's beautiful right now, it's about 74 degrees and there is, the weather's perfect, but in the morning sometimes it is a drizzle or a light rain. And even though we're underneath the patio, I do have some rugs that may be exposed that I don't necessarily want to get wet. Taking my time getting this together, it will probably be a very hot summer. And I'm not sure what is wrong with this barking dog, but oh well, we in America love our dogs, right? I'm gonna start by painting another layer of paint on this glass tabletop. It was glass. I do have a video as to how you can paint your glass tabletops a color. I've had this table for about, I don't know, gosh, over 20 years. At first, the table was, this is from the old Bombay, the Bombay store. Leave a comment for all of you guys that remember the Bombay. So it was inside of the house when I first purchased it. The bottom of it was the iron, the iron color wrought iron. It has been black, now it's white. I keep things for a very long time. So it will come out and have another life at a different time. out of the way, I hope, I think I can. A little bit, let's see. Okay guys, I just decided to give up on speaking and decided to do a voiceover. Right now I am editing out the space, just removing items that I probably will not use. decided to spray the area that I will have furniture or seating placement and this spray I cannot speak enough about I will leave a link in the description no bugs no ants nothing nada it is wonderful and one spray pretty much in the beginning of the season the summer and it will last me throughout until we get another rain absolutely love this stuff. I use it around the entire property. I'm working with a lot of black this year for 2023 and it's just a classic clean color. I'm adding the stripe to have interest. that you are your own producer of this project. I'm my own editor of the project. As I'm going along, I have things in my mind that I actually wanna do, but it all depends on the way it folds out. This isn't pre-planned, just the general concept is. I'm allowed to edit 
just like you are allowed to edit whatever it is that you want in your home, as long as you're creating your own utopia and you're making your home your sanctuary. Enjoy the process along with me, starting off with this striped rug. For this area, I decided on orange terracotta being my pop of color, and I will combine the two rugs, the orange and the black. It is loads of texture, color, and interest in the space. And I absolutely love it. The black and white striped is an outdoor rug. The terracotta orange print rug is an indoor rug, but I love it. I don't care that it's indoor. I will be utilizing it. It's a five by seven, and I will take an indoor rug, use it outside all day long, as long as it's very pleasing to the eye and I try to make sure that I maintain it as best as possible. Let's talk about these chairs. The chairs were white and they were great as a white color, but when I painted them black, it gave the chair new life. That black with the terracotta and the stripe it is absolutely gorgeous. The chairs look rich. They look brand new. These are the chairs. They were off-white, white color. Over the years, they turned into an off-white. I'm so glad that I painted them black because now the chair has taken on a new meaning. Next, I'm bringing in this small table and I'm using it as a base for the glass tabletop that I painted previously. And I needed something round. I wanted it to be pretty low profile to the ground, but not super, super low. I love the detail of the wire. We're not going to see the wood, but that's okay. It is just the black wire with the scroll pattern that I absolutely love. I'm going to try to move this table and <laughs> get it over to the new location without breaking the top. I'm spraying the finish enamel to give it a little bit more protection and I really think it's going to work. I'm hoping it does work. Bringing in the remaining two chairs, there will be four chairs in this area. Cleaning off the back mirror. This mirror stays out year round, but you can see all of the dirt on the right corner and what it looks like when it's cleaned on the left side.
I purchased the jute cushion at my local home goods I thought it was just perfect it allows more comfort in the chair because this is a hard plastic chair and just to have a little bit more comfort you'll sit longer Loving the way things are coming together with the white table, the wired base, the black chairs. Decided to add a beige pillow. Next, I'm addressing the tree base, the planter, and there's a simple trick. I went over to the local 99 cent store and picked up the pool noodles. They're only like a dollar. I will cut them to size, different sizes, it really doesn't matter. I will use them to add filler inside of the vase. The fun part, it's time to decorate. The table has dried. I can start bringing things onto the table that I want to see every day that I absolutely love. The candles that I'm placing on the table are battery operated. I found them in the corner, probably purchased them some time ago for a client and decided not to use them, but it's going to be to my advantage because I'm using them now. They're battery operated and you have a remote control. Enjoy the remaining of the video. Leave a comment and let me know what was your favorite part. Until next time, make every single day a great day. It's in my birthday, yeah, cause I gotta say You're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, baby Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of it Baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe And right away I so much time Looping in the blurry lights Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of Don't look, they're like everything that has a cherry on top Get on
If you like this video, hit that like button or subscribe. You will be notified each time there is a new upload. Until next time, make every day a great day.